advertising is very much depending on the economy and on the um, on the sale of goods. So if um, this tax had happened, obviously it would have an, a negative in, a, impact on the sale of, of goods, which would have affected the advertising market, for sure. I mean, what's interesting about the business, if we look about the, uh, the technology, is how much you guys are focused on the two-screen story now mm -hmm. and the way that you can use out-of-home advertising as a way of reinforcing messages, perhaps, that you receive through your mobile phone or on other digital devices here. So I guess anything that damages confidence around the digital proposition is not necessarily a good news story as you say no it's not and we are um, the most digitized out of home media company in the world and uh, last year we will uh, last year we did about 25 percent of our revenues coming from digital and that only in five countries which represent about 70 percent of our digital income uh, out of 82 countries in which we operate uk is the most digitized um, advertising market in the world we generate about 70 percent of our advertising revenues in the uk from digital it has become the showcase for the rest of the world. Uh, we have more screens in uh, London than in New York and Melbourne combined, for, exa for example. And uh, it's a kind of our showcase which we uh, use in order to deploy our digital equipment around the world. Jean-Francois, how challenged is your business model at the moment by 21st century trends, uh, which you both have just alluded to as well? And I, and I look at why Monsieur Macron wants to have some form of deal on this as well. It's not just about revenue for the exchequer in France as well. This is about offsetting concerns that French people have, and in fact people generally, uh, about digitization, taking away their jobs, taking away their traditional business models as well. In many ways, I know you're digital in many ways, but you're also a very traditional business model with outdoor advertising, outdoor street furniture as well. How challenged are you at the moment? Digital is, a, is an opportunity for us because our audience keeps on growing. You have more than 50% of the world population living in cities. This number will go up to 75%. The population will go from 7 to 9 billion. And we are in areas like airports, railway stations, subway stations where there is a captive audience and more and more people are using public transport. And I see it so all the time. But how pedantic am I by asking this question? There is nothing green in 21st century about digital advertising on boards where before it was some bloke, 5 a.m. in the morning, putting out with his, uh, with his mop and what have you. It, it, it's a lot a more, it's a hell Steve, of a, using a car. It's a hell of a lot more energy needed yeah. to, to power your digital advertising yeah. around the globe. Yes. Um, this year, we will achieve about, uh, cover 75% of our electro electrical consumption with green energy. Sure and we will reach 100% uh, green energy by 2022, which is one of the reasons why um, the CDP, the Carbon Disclosure Project, which um, is rating about 8,000 companies ar around the world, uh, that's about 50% of the uh, uh, market cap globally, and 1,000 cities and states put us on their A list um, a few days ago, um, given all the initiatives that we are taking to reduce our electrical consumption. Given that, uh, you're right, Steve, we operate about 1.1 million advertising panels around the world, and electrical consumption is a big thing. Mm. But having said that, while we deploy digital, we reduce the number of um, uh, static, traditional advertising displays. So we have less advertising displays, but more digital. Okay. So net, 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 the electrical consumption goes down. Hi, I'm Giovanna Bersecchi, and thank you for watching. You can check out more of our videos by clicking on the boxes on the screen. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more from CNBC International. Thank you for watching.